about 1.3 billion years ago when no humans lived on earth an interesting event occurred in universe two black holes orbiting each other came closer closer and closer and boom collided but why did they come closer for this they must somehow lose energy well energy was lost in the form of gravitational waves also after collision the energy equivalent to three solar masses was lost as these waves Wait, but what are gravitational waves? These are the disturbances in space-time curvature itself which travel at the speed of light. But we can even see space-time. No worries. Now let's visualize its effect in space. Imagine a ring of particles in a plane. Then think of a gravitational wave passing perpendicular to the plane. What happens? In one direction, they come closer and in the other, they go away and vice versa and so on. It's just like stretching and compressing of a space causing rings distortion. On September 14, 2015, gravitational waves finally reached Earth. How could they sustain for so long? That's what makes them so special. Unlike electromagnetic waves, they interact very feebly with matter in terms of energy, scattering or absorption. So how we detected them? Simple using laser interferometry in which the split beams normally after reflection destructively interfere producing no interference pattern in the detector But when a gravitational wave passing through changes the length of the arms an interference pattern is detected and in this pattern is the information about the universe Okay, okay, okay. How do we have information? When the orbiting black holes came closer the orbital speed increase increasing the orbital frequency which in turn increased the frequency of gravitational waves being produced Detecting this increase in frequency as LIGO did in graph shown, it can help predict the collision. Amazing! Earth without LIGO was like human without ears, which only had its telescopic eyes to view the universe. But now, just like we perceive surrounding via sound, wait, sounds like I've heard it before. Also, just like our brain can specify the direction of a sound using the time delay for the sound to reach the second year, LIGO with this network of detectors perceives the universe in the same way. Why on earth do they matter? With the secure information they bring to us, we learn not only about space gobbler black holes, but also about neutron stars, supernova, gamma ray bursts, stellar evolution, and the possibilities are endless. And surprisingly, they will also allow us to peek into the moment just after Big Bang. And the great thing is, it adds up to multi-missions astronomy along with electromagnetic waves, neutrinos, cosmic rays to study this amazing universe of ours. Gravitational waves are really amazing. You can even realize how useful they are to astronomers. Every time an astronomer started looking at the universe with different kind of lights, new discoveries were made and gravitational waves are no exception. With just five years of discovery, we have learned so much about the universe through these waves and the future is even more surprising. So stay curious. Thank you.